Chris, thank you. It's been two days now since the release of that stunning investigation accusing River Beach City employees of falsifying test results to hide fecal and E. coli contamination of the city water supply. Leaders met for the first time tonight since that report came out, but they did not discuss it, even though the public certainly wanted to. Ari Height was at the meeting and has more on the harsh words that were exchanged tonight. The inspector general's report was not on the agenda for this utility special district meeting, and so it wasn't even brought up until the public had a chance to speak. And then the public lashed out at city leaders. It did not take long for tempers to flare in Riviera Beach Wednesday night. This is the number one issue in this city. This has to stop. We're looking to you for the answers. The city's residents are talking about this, a report released Monday by the Office of the Inspector General saying city employees in 2023 improperly tested and at times even falsified test results, hiding problems with the city's water quality. There was a crime committed against me, against every resident in this city, and nothing's happened. That is unacceptable. The four people named in the report no longer work for the city. This is the first utility special district meeting since that report came out, but the report was not on the agenda and the board never brought it up. But that only made public speakers even angrier. I'm a little upset that we're not talking about what's been coming out in the news lately. It's kind of like, let's just brush, let's just, shh, shh, no one will know. How can you say you have our best interests at heart and it doesn't, no actions prove that? City manager Jonathan Evans responded to the comments by offering to talk with anyone at any time. If you would like to have a meaningful, substantive conversation about ways we can move this city forward, I will come to your homes to do that. But Mayor Ronnie Felder says it's past the time for talking. He called for Evans to be fired. And not to be quick because we need strong leadership in this city. Council members did not discuss the idea of firing Evans. Instead, they chose to vote unanimously to schedule a special meeting to discuss the inspector general's report. At this point, no date has been set for that special meeting. In Riviera Beach, Ari Height, WPBF 25 News.